Here's a side-by-side -side comparison of the Sanjian and the Tivoli desktop radio. This is WR11, and this is the classic one, Model 1 from Tivoli. Uh, it has on-off switch, FM, AM, and aux input. There is a volume dial. Let's compare the FM performance. Fast and get more cash. The internet the has changed everything. Can you even I'm using internal built-in antenna. And this is the Sam Jun one, Sam Jun. Stop playing the dealer trade games. Take a minute. Personally, I prefer this video, uh, this radio over this one because it has better reception and better audio. Uh, you will see why. It also has this off FM AM selection. It's easier to dial. And there's a green button light up. If you see here, I'm going to turn the volume all the way down from the Tivoli audio. What are these customers complaining? As you can hear, there are lots of background noise between stations. Lots of lots of noise. So perhaps this is done digitally and this is more analog. I wouldn't say it's bad, but just doesn't seem as refined as the San John. Very loud and pushes, it pushes a lot of um, air down here through this hole. Rubber feet. And the San Gen one has a subwoofer um, port, this base port in the back. Both supports the external antenna input. You have the internal external antenna selection on both models. The antenna um, 75 ohms. This is also 75 external EM antenna input. Um, this one doesn't uh, have that, uh, you know, 3.5 jack for a, uh, AM antenna. Headphone jack output, stereo output. Record out that that is line out, line out, aux input, aux input. 12 volt, it supports 12 volt DC input, 12 volt 800 milliamps. Uh, this one has 12 volt 1 amp, so if you may want to get rid of this um, um, AC transformer or internal one, you may want to use the um, DC input to perhaps get rid of the uh, background noise sometimes or statics. I never tried that. And uh, I, th I think this is served as FM antenna. I mean, the AC cord rated at 25 watts max, 25 ma watts max, very similar um, spec. Stack them up. It is smaller than the sand gen. Let's try to dial into the same station. So it looks like around 100, I'm unable to dial into the same one. First, Washington's classic rock, Big 100. Big 100. Okay. Now you're listening to the Tivoli audio. Just 
Okay, so in my opinion, this one from Sanja sounds a lot more pleasant uh, since it's more like it has, it's been EQ'd for, to enhance bass and the highs. But the Tivoli audio is sort of a, sound, a flat sound profile. Perhaps it has a smaller speaker. I don't know the size of the speaker inside. Since the highs is a bit more enhanced, it feels like uh, you, you can you can uh, hear a lot more different details and levels from this song. Again. Lots of noise between stations. See the dialing? Quite basic. Seat belt at least check to make sure it's working. Yeah, as you can hear, it's um, it's it's easier to tune to a station without all these noise. Again. Lots of lots of uh, random noise from the table audio. Green button. All right. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you find this review helpful. Oh, again, um, the Tivoli audio is not as good as the Sanja based on my test. Uh, this is definitely a much, much better choice if you are shopping for a classic um, and retro style radios for the desktop. I like this one a lot. <laughs>